the moon was formed over 4.5 billion years ago, and it is also considered a satellite because it orbits around the Earth. And it also has crystals that has enough fuel to fuel the Earth for a lifetime. This crystal is worth more than Oprah Winfrey. It is stored with minerals that Earth has never seen. This powerful crystal was discovered by China. But check this shit out though. I don't really think the moon is fucking with us like that because NASA scientists have revealed that the moon has been moving further away from Earth at a slow pace at the rate of 3.8 centimeters per year. As the moon orbits, it slows down the Earth's rotation. For instance, if the moon ever vanished, it's gonna throw the Earth off balance and that motherfucker gonna tilt like a T.I. hat. That bitch gonna lean and most definitely all of the seasons are gonna be fucked up. For example, your ass gonna be outside enjoying the summer with your family and as soon as you wake up, it's gonna be winter with a happy ass snowman outside your house. The ocean tides would be small as hell and we would only have six hours of daylight. But anyways, when India landed on this motherfucker, I couldn't believe my fucking eyes. Cause what in the Lego technology is this bullshit? Right now, I'm trying to figure out what the hell they spent 75 million on. Cause this shit ain't it. Cause on everything I love, I was waiting on a block man to jump out that motherfucker. Man, fuck that shit. Turn it up a notch. I got six dollars for the first country to moon land during the lunar eclipse. It would only be up to 250 degrees. I think that should be cool.